What's up, YouTube? Mr. Lamacy here, and today I want to talk through how to log in to the other regions in the game. Now, this is probably going to be a simple guide for many of you. You're going to be like, ah, whatever. And there is one nice thing that you might actually learn from it that's actually one of my favorite things ever. But um, I do want to go ahead and show you changing regions because while the servers are global, they're not exactly global. They're still separated into three separate regions, but you have cross save essentially or cross play, whatever kind of across the regions. Um, and so it's a little bit interesting. So if you are in Diablo 2 resurrected and you're playing, you have to exit out uh, or not. And we'll show that in a bit. Um, but let me go ahead and go to the page. If you go to your Battle.net launcher, and I'm hiding stuff because eh, there might just be things over there that shouldn't be shown. Um, like, like all the friends on my list and stuff. Uh, if you come right here, right, you have the play and Deets Resurrected, but right here you have the regions. So you can actually go here and Asia, America, and Europe, you can change whatever region you want to get on right here, and this is how you can play on another region, right? So if I want to play on Europe, I change this to Europe, I press play, and now it will launch this into Europe. So this is how you can switch and play on different regions and play with people in the different regions or if there's, you know, D clones being spawned on Asia or being spawned somewhere else, you can go ahead and switch over there. Right? So this is the first and easy and obvious way that you can go ahead and make that switch. Now, the second way once we get logged in is going to be uh, one of the greatest and most underrated quality of life features that I believe the game has. I know there's no cam, that's fine. Um, so if you go into the game and you go into the lobby, if you have friends, now, I mean, yeah, you have to have friends first, but if you have friends, you can literally come to your friends list, go over here, and then if somebody is in a game, which we can see, uh, try and see if any of my friends, there we go. You can actually join, right click, and it doesn't matter what server they are on. Nano is on the US servers, and I'm on the EU servers. Uh, you can then join their game, and it will actually join you across the server. And so now I'm on the US servers playing in Nano's game. This is the greatest quality of life feature that I have ever seen. Um, that like nobody talks about, but it's amazing. And so literally, like I say, now if you come down here, I mean, it's not gonna show it there, but I'm actually on the America servers now, right? Uh, so it actually has switched me over to America servers, um, which is just absolutely fantastic. And uh, I love it, being able to just go to your friends and then you can just, you know, find whoever you want who's playing right click on them and if they're in a game you can just join right from there and it'll cross server join and everything it is super super nice um so those are the two ways to jump servers or switch servers whatever it is like i say if someone's your battle.net friend or if it's somebody that you recently played with that's also going to be in that list right so again if we go back to this right here, you can see there's friends, but then there's also just recently played with. And anybody that was in like the previous game or something, you should be able to do the same thing. Potentially. You might have to be friends with them still to do it. But um, yeah, it's super, super nice. Absolutely love it. Um, and this is, like I say, just, just super underrated as an overall quality of life feature that got added. Being able to just instead of hey what's the game name and password and it's this complex thing or i forget where i'm you just join off your friend if you're doing bail runs with a group you literally exit that right click join game and you're all in on the next game and you can just keep rinse and repeating uh that that way if somebody wants to trade with you that's your friend and they're on a different region or whatever you just join their game from there um it makes your life super easy but of course if it's none of that, and you just want to go and, like, be on a different region for whatever reason. You know, somebody's trading something, and they're on a different region, things like that. You can just go and change it in the launcher, restart the game there, and uh, join in. So, like I said, I know it's not the most complex guy, but I've seen a lot of people that have just been sitting there saying, Oh, well, I'm on 
you know, you're up, so I can't trade with you. I'm sorry. And it's like, no, you can't. Um, so I think enough people didn't know about that that I wanted to make a little video on it for you guys and then include that nice quality of life feature because it's super nice. Regardless, thank you guys for watching. I hope that this was helpful. Peace, YouTube.